Well, the first thing that we notice in Microsoft Word 2007 is that the old menu and toolbar system, characteristic of previous versions, has had a complete overhaul. Enter the ribbon. Designed with speed and ease of use in mind, it aims to provide the same and more functionality with fewer clicks of the mouse. This is done by bringing the more popular commands to the front so you don't have to search for them. The ribbon is divided into tabs home, insert, page layout, etc. Each tab being geared towards a certain activity area. Within each tab is a selection of groups, font, paragraph and so on, that show related items together. Command buttons in each group carry out a command or display a menu of commands. Using this hierarchy, similar commands are grouped together making the ribbon very task oriented. The Home tab contains all the things you use most often such as commands in the font group for changing text size, text colour, background colour and the list goes on. If you can't find a certain command that you used in previous versions of Word, don't panic. Some groups have a small diagonal arrow in the bottom right hand corner, the dialog box launcher. Clicking it reveals more options related to that group. The tabs in the ribbon are sensitive to the context in which you are working. To illustrate this, let's insert an image into this Word document by going to the Insert tab and clicking on Picture. And here's a photo of me on holiday which we're going to insert. Notice that while the picture is selected, the Context Sensitive Picture Tools tab is displayed. Clicking away from the picture and the Picture Tools tab disappears. The Picture Tools tab is an example of an on-demand tab. Tables and charts also have on-demand tabs. 